Hey guys, what's up? It's your boy Picasso here again with another vid real quick. I was just going through the Play Store looking at some third party uh, apps and I came across this right here. As you can see, it's already installed. It's called Home Base Lock Screen. Now, um, I've actually seen this in the Play Store for a while, um, so it's nothing new really. And if any of you guys are familiar with it, then you know exactly what it's about. And for those of you who don't know what it's about, you know, other than the side, the point that it is a, a third-party lock screen, we're going to go right into it and see what it has to offer. All right, let's go and do that. Okay, so right off the bat, this is home base lock screen so here it is showing you how it works so first off let's zoom in here a little bit so you can see what home base is all about now it lets you know that home base is a uh, welcome to home base swipe right to discover what home base can do we'll swipe right and then it says never miss a moment enjoy all your social feeds in one place breaking news get the latest news in sports tech and more Going over, then it says 321 launch. Your most used apps are now a finger slide away. Personal assistant, pull the sidebar for settings, SMS. Pull the sidebar for settings, SMS, call logs, and weather. Okay, then we got express yourself, choose your background lock icon, and unlock sound, and unlock sound of your home base. Then we have shop smarter, discover great deals tailor made for you. Okay. And then it says log in or tap to continue. I'm gonna go ahead and skip that. It's a, it's a cool lock screen. There's nothing very very special about it. Um, as you see there, it did just uh, turn over itself to another page. Uh, what's great about this app is that when pressing the unlock button to unlock, you get this cool little. Uh, quick launcher and basically you can set what these targets are okay so that's pretty cool and of course you can slide left to go to the camera you can slide right to unlock the device next thing about that if you were to go ahead and swipe to the left you have a universal search we're typing in anything there uh, let's just type in uh, galaxy let's type in galaxy Space. Oh, something happened there. I don't know what happened. So there we go. Let's go. Galaxy Space uh, S5. And let's hit search. And let's see what happens there. Um, okay. Well, it shouldn't go to there first. So typing in Galaxy S5 at the top, you see that it does bring up some searches there, some results. And as you see, those are internet based you know videos there's one right there it does bring up internet based video search, uh, search results okay so that's pretty cool and if you want to go ahead and swipe again to the uh, continue swiping left then you see it brings up a widget page where you can go ahead and tap and it enables you to add various widgets okay so I'll go ahead and add I'll just add Play Store recommendations okay then we slide back over and there you go that is the Play Store recommendations so the widgets actually come before the search as you can see right there and meanwhile everything is there with that unlock uh, toggle right there you can just go ahead and add widgets just add whatever you like I'll add that scrollable there and there it is that's one of them there and there's the next one there it kind of reminds me of um, Facebook home you know the Facebook home launcher that's what this home screen con this lock screen reminds me of alright um, and now if you scroll to the right basically it shows you some apps scroll right again then it also it also puts you into uh, uh, your Facebook feed your Instagram feed your Google Plus feed I think your Twitter feed as well so as you can see there it comes up so again this is why I said it kind 
kind of reminds me of that uh, Facebook home launcher, uh, basically where you have the feeds on your lock screen. See, and again, another app here that it's uh, letting you know that you could uh, purchase. This is my Instagram feed. This right here, uh, it's loading. I'm not sure what feed that is. Uh, this is Twitter feed. Um, that's Twitter feed. So, you know, it gives you your information even without unlocking the screen. So that is pretty cool. Um, now, let's go ahead and we can actually get into the settings. So diving into the settings, of course, the top one is enable the lock screen. Then we have the streams. So when you press the streams, there you go. You have F Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. So this is where you also come and you choose your feeds that you want to see. Um, so of course, I got Sports Illustrated uh, going down. I'm actually going to select ESPN. Then we're going to keep going. Then I got Google News. Um, da, 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 da. I have CNET, of course, and if I'm not mistaken, I would have BT, but BT's fallen off. Uh, that's a whole other thing. TMZ, I like to laugh at some of the celebrities when they're up to their foolishness, so I have that. And Yahoo News. Um, yeah, and I have Top News. So you get to choose a custom background, custom logo, custom sound, and sidebar color. Now I can't see the sidebar, I think maybe because I have pie controls on, but I'm sure if I was to take off pie controls, then we would be able to see that sidebar. So you can change all of that, you can select a custom logo, you can choose an image, or you can choose from the online gallery that they have. And let's just go there, and there is a few, let's just go and click home. And let's see what that icon is. There we go. It's just a quick little uh, house icon. Um, let's go back. Let us take a look at it. Um, there we go. And as you can see, that thing has turned into that little home icon now. Here's where we have Launcher Editor. Okay, and Launcher Editor is where uh, you're able to select what you want to launch on those icons as I showed you before okay let's go back then of course widgets you have uh, you can add your widgets from here as well and you can also delete your widgets from here just by tapping delete and the widgets are gone let's go back then we have advanced settings where you have security, weather units, restore lock screen, uninstall home base, feedback and more Okay, guys, so that's a look at a home base lock screen. Your boy Paul Picasso, Picasso Entertainment. It's tech time. Stay tech. Always be tech. I'll see you in the next one, guys. Peace.